politics. Yeah. You tell me in any country, including Morocco, where you have any development agenda without political blessing, tell me, none. Because it is the National Assembly, some will call it parliaments, of our respective countries who endorse all those projects, programs, they have to go through the political process. I have learned that in the first, first hand, as a, a seasoned uh, climate change negotiator at the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change in Bonn, Germany, mainly, we do three, year, uh, three weeks straight, almost 20 hours a day, negotiating on one agenda item. The last week of those negotiations, that's where the politicians come, presidents, vice presidents, prime ministers, ministers come. We submit, we make a presentation to them, we submit our report on the negotiation, the outcome of the negotiations. You know what they tell us? Thank you very much for that hard work. But I think as a country, we will go bilateral, meaning we will negotiate with, for example, United Kingdom. Although our views, our recommendations were not to agree with the United, Nation, uh, with the United Kingdom on a particular agenda item, but they will take it up and push it aside, and they go their political way. That's how they get money. I said, aha, so this is a trick. That is why I am impressed, I'm inspired that I will get into politics as of this year. And, and I will run for the presidency of Uganda in 2026, December 2026. <laughs> and my colleague here and I, we don't belong to different parties. Well, we discussed a lot of things, you know, commonality about how to move the Gambia. So, I might, uh, Mr. Chair, if I conclude, I would like to urge all of you in your respective countries, in your respective communities, please partake in politics. You know, Africans generally, we don't understand what politics is. We always think politics is about killing each other, about insulting each other, about physically fighting. No, that is wrong. That is the perception of people who get into politics. But politics is all about development. So please, I urge all of you to start up today, if you have never done before, get into grassroots politics in your respective countries. You will see what I'm telling you. Thank you very much.